Hi, my name is Paul Offit. I'm talking to you today from the Vaccine Education Center at the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. It is June 7th, 2024. Now, at the end of February this year, the CDC made a recommendation that was a change in some ways for the way that we use the COVID vaccine. What they said was that everybody over 65 years of age could consider getting two doses during the year rather than one, with those two doses separated by at least four months. So why did they make that recommendation? There really were two reasons. One is that it is clear that after about six months, protection against disease, even severe disease, does start to fade, especially for those at highest risk of severe disease. The second reason is that there's not yet a clear seasonality for COVID. Unlike influenza, which is a winter disease, or respiratory syncytial virus, which is a winter disease, COVID can really occur throughout the year. So therefore, you're at risk throughout the year. Recently, we were asked a question by um, one of the people who follow our Vaccine Education Center, whether it would also be reasonable for other people to get two doses through the year, such as other people who are at high risk. For example, people who have high-risk medical conditions like obesity, or diabetes, or chronic lung, heart, or kidney disease, or people who are taking immune compromising medications, but are nonetheless all less than 65. I think the answer to that question is yes. I think that that would be reasonable for those people who are at high risk groups, but nonetheless less than 65, to get two doses during the year with those two doses separated by at least four months. Thank you.